A man's account of a terrible first date recently went viral. He took a woman out to dinner. She ordered lobster and an expensive glass of wine totaling 180 bucks. The guy, who's a student, got pasta and a beer totaling $20. Mm. His date became outraged and called him rude when the check came because he refused to pay her portion of the tab. Is it okay to order expensive items on the menu on a first date? If you're going on a date and he picks the place, buddy, you gotta know the lay of the land. If there's lobster on the menu, whatever's on the menu, you should know. I, should I disagree. Know. I totally disagree. So I had this boyfriend who was a complete scrub and he used to come out to dinner with my family and think it was like a free for all. He would order like the caviar lobster. I'm like, what are you doing? By the way, grounds for dismissal right there. I just think it's rude to go in so, you know, brazen and bold. Adriana could not disagree more. And here's why, is I think that it is important when you go on a date for a woman to simply be yourself. If you would take yourself to dinner and have lobster and a great glass of wine, then you certainly should do it if a man is taking you to dinner. The only time it becomes an issue is if you start going out with somebody and suddenly now you all brand new and you ordering stuff you have never had in your life. I agree with the combination of it. If you're gonna take a woman out, fellas, you got to know the lay of the land. If it's out your league, don't go there. If you ain't got lobster money, then you gotta go somewhere where the lobster's affordable. See, red lobster. <laughs> right. <laughs> By the way, if she moved me as a student, even more of the reason to hold back. But sometimes- He doesn't have a huge income. But sometimes men need to be put on the spot. Yes. Right? But listen, when I first started dating my husband, I invited him to my house for dinner. And he said, so can I bring something? And I said, yeah, you can. Why don't you grab a bottle of Opus One wine? Opus One? Opus That's One. Fancy. Opus One. And not only did he bring one bottle, he brought two. And it took him about five years to tell me that he almost had a heart attack when he realized the <laughs> bottle of wine yes. was like $250 a bottle. By the way, I would have said bring a bottle of wine right. and, and the quiz or like my internal test would have been to see what kind of wine he showed up with. Now, men ain't that smart. No. You got to tell them. That's why I ended up You got to tell them, baby. You got to tell I'm them. Tell you right now. <laughs> No, nah, we ain't. Yeah. Bottle of wine. Sophisticated. It shows that they have Silver that Oaks is seventy nine dollars, <laughs> and it's delicious. That's a great wine. So is Yellowtail. <laughs> yeah, yellow I mean tail. really. So, but you know, uh, and then at the same time, like uh, Adriana said, if it's a student, Look. come on now, don't don't jam him up. But Steve, if I'm high maintenance all day every day, why all of a sudden just because I'm going on a date with you now I need to fall back? I understand what you're saying, but the ignorant part was when the bill came, yeah. he <gasps> want her to pay. That was horrible. That's, see, we, we've lost the art of chivalry. Yes. Let me give you the rules, gentlemen, and I don't care what nobody tells you, <laughs> this is the rule. If you invite a woman out and ask for her company, automatically, you should be willing to pay for the meal. Yes. yes. 100%. 100%. That's the rule, man. I've never gone out with a woman and not paid. You're a stand-up guy. You're a gentleman, you're I, a gentleman. I, I, I was exactly. a ra I can't. Yes. Yeah. I dated a girl years ago, and after the club, I asked her out, and she said, yeah. And she said, so where do you normally go? And I said, Denny's. Usually, the only thing open after the club is closed, anyway. So we go to Denny's, and I'm sitting there, and I'm sweating. <laughs> you know, because I got a 20. Oh. <laughs> And so I just waited on her to order. And she ordered the Grand Slam. Now, Denny's, that's $1.99. So I'm cool. But then she said, but you know what, though? Wait a minute, hold up. I think I'm going to try the, sh the spaghetti and shrimp dinner. <laughs> I wasn't ready for that. And I looked over, and that was like $8 or something. <laughs> so I'm going, OK, hold up. If she trip <laughs> and order something else. So I had the special, the $1.99 special, and was just praying that she filled up. So I kept asking for water. You know, they kept bringing water. I kept sliding it over. Oh, that's funny. And, and, and that was it, man. But... but it shows that you were a gentleman. I don't care what the money was. I don't care how much it cost. It shows that you were a gentleman from day one. She was fine. I was going to let her eat the whole 20. <laughs> Priorities, ladies. Yeah. Priorities. 
Oh, she was fine. <laughs> Ain't no doubt about it. Hey, we got to take a quick break. We got more straight talk right after this. Hey, you made it to the end of this video. I got a lot more that you're going to enjoy, so just click to watch the next one. And make sure you subscribe to always know what's happening.